Hi, hello, thank you for watching. Today I'm going to show you how you can post ads on GCG every 10 minutes, all automated with this auto posting software. So, the first thing is go to posting, then you go to GCG, this is going to open the GCG interface, and basically, we are going to extract ads from Craigslist and post them on GCG. So, how would we do that? The first step is go to the number 5 generate extraction list we're going to select country we're going to select all crack list and we're going to put the service that we want to offer or to promote these are only some ideas you can type uh, pretty much anything you want so let's say I'm going to put uh, uh, I'm going to put WordPress so I put WordPress then I choose a uh, service offer and then I click all cities this is going to generate me a file with all the correctly cities uh, and basically every link it's going to contain about uh, well usually they contain 100 ads but because you're doing uh, a, a keyword research probably it's going to be less but anyway uh, each, each link contains many ads that you can grab and then use for you uh, to post on QGG so basically I copy this I open a notepad I paste it inside then I save it and once I save it I'm going to have a list of, uh, of uh, files like this basically I save all those files I'm going to uh, select one of those files to use so the first uh, then I go back here on the extract from ads from Craigslist I click load I click open and basically I choose the WordPress service offer that I want to promote this is going to show me uh, 100, 514 links, uh, that's 514 ads, uh, 514 cities what you can get ads from. So I just click select random and as you can see the link here is going to change and uh, basically this allows me to choose randomly between the 514 ads. So I don't have to click one and then go to the other one and then go to the other one. It's just, it's just faster. So let's say I just choose um, I just choose Miami. I click get ads. These are these ads are targeted only to WordPress. So I'm just going to get ads from WordPress. I I select one of them. I see how the ad look like. This one seems interesting to me. It's 500, 500, uh, 299 and 599. I can use this ad. I just click use this ad. And basically it's going to copy the title the ad body and basically because I have here my phone number I just click replace and then and the phone number gets changed if I were to have other information I can just copy the contact name obviously that's going to be your information not mine uh, so basically I, I just fill out this I can change my prices to whatever prices I have and I just click add to list so I'm just going to choose another one I can do this uh, like let's say 54 times I just click use this ad obviously I, I wouldn't choose some that, some of them that have fun uh, replace ad so I have here my number I can change my website I, I have this image if I want to look for more images I just put here uh, website development and I just click search and it's going to go to Google I can just choose the image that I, I have there I just click right click open image location and I replace this image uh, sorry this one was not good because it's, this is, it didn't copy it properly okay so I just I just will paste it there let me just do it again with another ad I just click use this ad then I just erase this and I paste it. So click replace the phone, change my website, add posting to the list. So let's say I have these uh, these ads. Uh, imagine that I have t uh, 54 ads, and I'm going to click browse. I'm going to click desktop, and then I'm just going to click OK. Uh, I'm going to click here QGG ads, uh, WordPress. I click save to Excel. This is because I want to post the same ads over and over again, so 
and you're saving them to repost them so I click clear if you want to import them back again you click in import excel file browse then you go to your desktop or wherever you save them and then here I have well this is one I, I did previously but uh, kgg add wordpress so the ads are there I just click use this ad and basically my ads are there and I can post them so I already uh, logged in in kgg but if you haven't logged in to load your information there and click login it's going to go to this web browser and it's going to log, log in for you before posting I have to uh, fill out this information it's very important so it's going to click the, bra uh, the browse button for uploading the picture I click navigate and this is going to navigate to the posting page I click I scroll one time and I click move mouse this is going to move my mouse to the position that it's going to be clicking if my mouse were a little bit up here I have to compensate and check what is the actual uh, position of the mouse that it should be so I just place my mouse over the button I grab the number so I have here uh, 420 and 531 and uh, basically I put 420 and 531 uh, I already set it up for my numbers but you need to change this uh, whenever you are going to uh, start posting so I just go back here uh, I'm going to post uh, let's say uh, uh, 6 ads every 10 minutes so what I'm going to do is every 10 minutes it's going to post one ad so by one hour I'm going to have 6 ads uh, when, when I had uh, 12 ads it's going to pass 2 hours so at that point I'm going to stop the software and I'm going to delete the ads to delete the ads every time you, your ad is posted it's going to go here on the delete ads so let's just post these two ads and then just delete the, delete the same ads here I'm going to put one, 1 minute but you should really put 10 minutes I'm just going to do 1 minute so it's faster for you to see what I'm doing so I'm just going to click post all the ads basically it's going to go to KGG and it's going to start posting there and here it went to posting the status navigating to KGG visiting the posting section that you choose in this case you can choose different sections on different cities so whenever you create your ad with your ad you choose those cities what you want to post so as you can see it fill out the title it's focusing on the area text, it's filling out the ad description then it's going to scroll down to see the button and it's going to click save the ad so this is my ad but because I didn't have image it just jumped uh, right after to, to post it kind of fast so the next ad that is going to be post it should have the image so I just come back here to check the time Whenever this 54, 55 matches the number that I have here, it's going to start posting again. So here it's going to start posting again. So it's going to move into the navigating to KGG and then it's going to go to, to the visiting the posting section that I choose. In this case I choose services. If you choose a different section, it's going to go to the different section that you post. So it fill out the title, it's going to fill out the description. Uh, uh, right now it's focusing on the text area, it fill out the description. And then it's going to go down, it's going to click the select the photos. Uh, so I have to compensate, it's 54 that I have to put. So it's going to paste the image there. Here it was 50. So I have 50 there and as you can see the image was uploaded there so my ad is going to have an image and whenever this reached 55 then it's going to accept the ad and it's going to go to uh, but it, it finished the ad it finished posting the ad and this is going to go to the section where it, it, it just click the, the this button here oh, sorry this ad was too long so probably that's why it didn't click it so I'm just going to remove some uh, some text and I'm just going to click uh, I'm going to click affiche votre renouns actually that one I will just remove it completely but anyway 
So this ad has been posted. As you can see, the ad has been created. Uh, but my link on the delete option is not good. So I'm just going to de remove the last one that I did. And I'm going to create a new one. Okay, that's the, that's the ad, the previous ad. Just very quick, I'm going to just create a new one just for you to see how we delete multiple ads at the same time. So I just choose this one. I click just this ad. And then I just click add to image, add, add to the list. That is going to be here. I start posting the ad. It's going to post this ad now on, on, the, on the web browser window. Navigate to Kijiji. Well, as you can see, it's, uh, it's navigating to Kijiji. It's posting the ad. It's filling out the title, the description. It's putting in the image and it's clicking uh, save the ad so you can pretty much uh, use this to dominate GG post every 10 minutes and then after two hours if you stop your posting and you delete all your ads so you can post the same ads again or you can post different ads the idea is that you will be on top of the uh, ads every 10 minutes and that is going to give you tons of cards for your business so as you can see, the ad was created. It has keywords. It has the phone number that you're going to put here. It could have your URL, and you can have pretty much all the ads. And basically, basically, it just takes you seconds to to grab the ads from somebody else's. You just modify it to your own to your own necessities, and you have an ad created. So finally, let's say it passes the two hours. I'm just going to go here. Whenever I, I go on this uh, on these links, I can click click the lead and accept the lead to remove the ad uh, like one by one. But if I want to remove them all, I just click the lead ads from the table. This is going to go to visit the first ad. As you can see, it just visit the ad and it's going to click the lead and then it's going to accept the deletion of the ad. So that accept the, the the ad, then it's going to click uh, accept the, the the deletion of the ad. So the ad was deleted, even though it doesn't seem like it, but the ad was uh, was deleted. Whenever you visit that ad, it's not going to show there anymore. So this is the second ad. It's going to click delete, and then it's going to click uh, confirm deletion. Here is the the deletion. So the ad was deleted, and basically that's it. So just recapitulating everything very fast. You create your list of ads. You load your ad list here. You extract the ads. You use the ads that you want to post on on, on KGG. You change the information to match whatever you want to use for your ads. Then the ads is going to appear here. Sa whenever you have 54 ads, save them. Then uh, you can reduce them later. Import the ad import the ads. Uh, click uh, start posting all the ads. Uh, whenever you reach uh, two hours, uh, well, every 10 minutes it's going to post one ad, so you will have 12 ads. When you reach the 12 ads, you go here on web browser and you stop the uh, stop the posting. Then you will have here the link of the 12 ads that you post. You just click delete ads in table and basically it's going to delete the ads for you. That way your ads will be always on top and you will generate uh, tons of calls for your business. And if you have, if you choose really good ads from here with, uh, ton with content, uh, for example this one looks nice and it has uh, a lot of uh, text that basically they already did the work for you you just have to capitalize on it so uh, this is uh, one of the different modules that my software has as you can see it has a scraping you can uh, generate leads on job you can uh, extract uh, the keywords from YouTube videos check what are the top videos that are there you can uh, scrap Facebook fan pages and post on them. You can get proxies. You can post on Craigslist. 
uh, you can really do very nice things with this software so if you want to get the software there will be a link on the description of the video and there will be a link on the video itself that is going to uh, it's going to send you to the page where you can uh, read or let learn more about the different modules of the software and where you can download the software so thank you for watching and uh, I hope the, you find this software useful uh, and basically it's going to help you a lot for your marketing um, thank you and I see you in my next video bye bye